What's up, trainers? Big week this week. Lots of news, lots of things happening, and lots to talk about. First things first came the end of the Earth Day event. I hope you all got your new shiny whale mirrors. I sure didn't, even though I caught a whole bunch, but you know, he's not going anywhere, so eh, I'll just find a nest in the future. Also, as of yesterday, Zaptos is back as a research reward, so all those new players can now grab that legendary electric bird. I'm sure that'll make a lot of Instinct players very, very happy. And second item up, uh uh-oh, somebody let the cat out of the bag. That particular person, Niantic CEO, John Hankey. Hank? Hanky? Let's call him Hanky. A high level player called Dr. Pogo was sitting next to him on a plane and he let slip a few little details such as Generation 4 being worked on and a player versus player battle system. I mean, duh, Generation 4, we all know it's been worked on. As to how soon it's going to come out, uh, to your anniversary, end of this year, we don't know. But player versus player, now that is something that I've been looking forward to for ages. So I'm hoping that it's not too far away. Two year anniversary sounds like an awesome time to bring it out. Let's hope that happens soon. Third and last piece of official news, we have a new event. So soon after the other one, Jesus, gosh, Niantic, please give us a cool down here. It's called the Battle Showdown event, and it will be here until May 14th. That's two weeks. Long story short, we get increased spawns of fighting type Pokemon, and just from getting out and about today, there are tons of Makuhitas around, tons of Metatites, also Mankeys and Machops. I even got a couple of Brulooms today, which I never usually see around, so that was good. In addition, we get double XP for gym and raid battles. Woo! Get your raid passes out. I'm going to be hitting some tier fives this week to hit level 39. I'm very close. Only 100k off. Yes. Also, in addition, 3,000 Stardust for any raid done at all. That's awesome. I need some more Stardust. Always need Stardust. And one piece of rare candy. Woot woot. Also, for those guys who are hunting gold in their local gyms, there will be a two times multiplier towards gym points for the entire event. And if that's not enough, you get extra items for spinning gyms. And I can say if you have gold in any local gyms, you get tons of items. I saw some people got 63 items on their seven day spin today. And extra, there are limited time boxes in the shop again. And as usual, getting the ultra box is the best money for value. But wait, there's more. Tier 1 raids, Whalmere's back as a raid boss. Tier 2 raids, there are primates. Tier 3 raids are all fighting types, including Machamps, Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and Breloom. I've done it. They are all easy, soluble, with optimal level 30 mons. The website that I use, down below in the description. Pokebadler is an awesome website, gives you the optimal attackers for each raid boss, and you don't need to be a high level. You just got to use the right mons. Tier 4 raid boss, Polyrath. And, uh, oh, most important of all, Shiny Metatite and Shiny Makuhita are here. I'm still going to be out and about looking for my Shiny Whalmere because I really want one. And I might snag a Shiny Metatite or Makuhita or two. Hope you have a good week. Emmy Cat out. If you like this video, chuck us a like or a subscribe or leave us a nice little comment down below.